please state your name and proceed with your testimony. Thank you, Madam Chair and members of the board. Uh, my name is Matthew Kaiser. Um, I don't have anything new to add, but I'd like to go into more depth with what has been said. Um, cannabis in itself is a uh, polypharmaceutical. By denying access to raw plant material, you're denying access to hundreds of beneficial compounds that are in those plants that um, aren't being utilized now uh, by patients. Um, when we limit the, uh, the allowable number of cultivators, we're not only limiting patient access and, and keeping the price uh, at an unattainable rate, um, but we're also decreasing the amount of variety of um, cultivars that are available to patients. And one of the major things of research that is, that is coming out at this time is that it's the different ratios of all these chemicals. There's, there's terpenes, there's flavonoids, there's CBD, CBN, CBG, Delta 9, THC, Delta, uh, sorry, THCA, THCV, um, the, the list goes on. Um, and, and within those compounds, there's hundreds within them. It's the combination of all of those that can benefit one person or another person. And it's, and it's tailoring the medication to the needs of the patient. Um, we're limiting the cult we're, we're limiting the producers right now in what they can provide by only having two of them. Um, I, I also support the uh, provisions for expanding medical access to those of those of us that are on supervision. Um, I'm a medical I'm, I'm an allowable medical can medical cannabis patient in Minnesota, but I'm not allowed to use the medication. Um, I'm forced to go to a, a CBD, a full spectrum CBD product, which is still risky for me, um, as those products are not as heavily, um, there's, no, there's not as much oversight in that market as there is in the, uh, the cannabis industry in our state. Um, I support this bill, but I also support going much, much further, um, as everyone else has said. Thank you. Thank you for your testimony.